Stadium in Gainesville, Florida. We are at the Swamp, and it's the Home Depot SEC on CBS, our matchup in the SEC East. The Gamecocks of South Carolina against the Gators of Florida. Standings in the SEC, Florida still controls its own destiny. But after last week, it's a precarious spot as they lost badly at Arkansas. Still, they've got the tiebreaker over Kentucky. They need a win at home where they're perfect this season. Here come the Gators. Sixteen seniors for Florida coming out of that tunnel for the last time. And here's a guy that knows a little bit about the home locker room and the visitors' locker room. Will Muschamp and his South Carolina Gamecocks coming in here, and they're on a three-game winning streak. They've won four of the last six over Florida. And we welcome you, everybody, to Gainesville. Brad Nussler, along with Aaron Taylor, John Shriffin, will join us on the sideline shortly. A.T., a lot of plot lines in this game. First of all, South Carolina wants to get bowl eligible. Will's coming back. Jim McElwain's trying to straighten the ship out a little bit after what we saw a week ago. They can still win the East. And now both coaches have to do it with quarterbacks that didn't even start the season for them. Yeah, they do. And we were talking about it. You kind of get the feeling that today's game is a critical crossroad game for both of these teams where a win could kind of springboard them down the stretch for a good start. Now, Austin Appleby, he's getting his first start since a bandy game. He's got a big arm and could push the ball down the field vertically and that would be a welcome addition to this Gator offense. And how about Jake Bentley, the true freshman? Will Muschamp telling us the impressive start has made them better on both sides of the fall, but he's a freshman on the road going against a feisty defense, so communication and decision-making will be key. Four and a half years separates those quarterbacks in age. And oh, by the way, Will Muschamp spent the better part of four years as a head coach here at Florida. He returns as the head man of the Gamecocks. Riding a three-game winning streak from Columbia comes South Carolina. Florida needs a win at home to stay in the SEC East race. We'll kick it off when we come back.